Probably the most striking of all the cormorants is the imperial cormorant, or as it is known to some as the imperial shag. This serrated bill is good for behavioral duties, but it's also really good for catching fish. It comes from a group of blue-eyed cormorants, of which several subspecies have been elevated to species. This species is from the coastal areas of southern South America. It is monogamous and forms breeding colonies of hundreds of pairs. Despite its reliance on safety in numbers, many eggs and chicks are eaten by skuas and sheath bills, both avian predators of the southern ocean. Cormorants are excellent divers and feed mostly on the Argentine anchoita, a species of anchovy off the coast of southern South America. They also eat crustaceans, bristle worms, marine snails, and octopuses. Skuas are always trying to get a free lunch. Feeding ranges are close to the shore. Imperial cormorants can dive as deep as 50 meters in order to feed. After diving and feeding for 30 minutes, they have to return to land in order to dry their plumage. Imperial cormorants can also be found on inland lakes in the foothills of the Andes. Here, a mother forcefully feeds her youngster, who by now is an adolescent and seems to resist his mother's desire to pass on some delicious fish goo. This rock cormorant mother is also concerned about her baby's hunger. Nice place to hang out. <laughs> <laughs> 